Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is me, Dennis Kolros from Germany. I want to introduce you the world's strongest fan. So if you want to see very high quality strongman content, follow him and enjoy. Hey guys and welcome back to another video. First up it's South African powerlifter Nicholas Dupreez doing some pin presses. The weight 240 kilos or 529 pounds. Next up it's Julius Maddox, also working on the bench. This time though it's 274 kilos or 605 pounds for two reps with a pause. Now next up it's Germany's strongest man Dennis Kolrus, working with an Atlas stone. Do not try that at home. Following on from him it's Tom Owens. He's working on the loaded dumbbell. The weight today, 85 kilos or 187 pounds. Next up we join Chris Harper, he's also training loaded dumbbell today. The weight of his is slightly heavier, 93.5 kilos or 206 pounds. Next up we've got a really special lift, it's Ben Donin, the under 80 kilo strongman from France. Here's the new world record, it's 103 kilos or 227 pounds. He's got an awesome technique and that's the new under 80 kilos world record. Now he's back again, it's Dennis Colrus, this time with a seared dumbbell. That's 124.5 kilos or 274 pounds. Here's a clip from Dominic Creaky working on the axle with a weight of 183 kilos or 405 pounds. We now move into some log pressing and first up it's Gavin Bilton. That looked really easy. Next up and also pressing log, this time from the rack, it's a new strict rep personal best for Jack Osborne, 183.5 kilos, awesome. Next up we're out at America's strongest man, here is Tyler Cotton, the weight of that log, 199.5 kilos or 440 pounds. Someone else also hitting that weight is Wesley Claiborne, proving that both of those guys have got some really strong shoulders and could potentially compete at the world's strongest man in 2023. Now speaking of athletes that have been to worlds, here is Graham Hicks. That's 300 kilos or 661 pounds in the Viking press. Seriously strong stuff. We now move into some squatting and first up it's powerlifter Dan Grigsby. The weight on his bar today, 279 kilos or 615 pounds for two reps. Following on from him, it's William Relf with a new personal best, 280 kilos or 617 pounds on the bar. We now join powerlifter Jamal Browner, also squatting, the weight 320 kilos or 705 pounds for two reps. Here's a massive lift from Jesus Olivares, 415 kilos or 915 pounds and it looked easy. We've now got a couple of moving events. He's back again, it's Dominic Creaky with a farmer's walk, 159 kilos or 350 pounds in each hand. Following on from him, it's Gavin Bilton with the super yoke. That's 380 kilos or 838 pounds, moving strong and steady. We now move into the deadlift section and first up it's Graham Hicks. He's doing an EMOM for 20 minutes. That's 300 kilos or 661 pounds every minute on the minute. Here's a clip from Tom Owens, a new personal best at a body weight of 105 kilos. Following on from him, we join Joe Oliver, also hitting a personal best. It's 350 kilos or 771 pounds and he rounds out the first half of today's video. Now we're back again and it's more deadlifting. First up it's powerlifter Dan Grigsby. The weight, 355 kilos or 783 pounds for three reps. Next up and also pulling three reps, this time for a personal record, it's powerlifter Bob Matthews. 360 kilos or 793 pounds. Great work from Bob. Next up it's Gavin Bilton who says his training is moving along nicely but having a dose of man flu didn't help. He's still got plenty of time to keep working hard and battle it out for Britain's strongest man in 2023. He says he can't wait. 
Next up, it's powerlifter Yang Su Ren pulling in a sumo stance, a weight of 370 kilos or 815 pounds. Now someone else also pulling that weight is Italian Matteo Toninelli. It's a personal record for him. With a bit of a hitch, he gets a good lift. Now following on from Matteo, we join powerlifter Jamal Browner. He's also deadlifting, this time in a sumo stance with a pause. The weight, 385 kilos or 848 pounds for three reps. Here's a clip from Steve Tripp pulling in competition a weight of 388 kilos or 855 pounds. Next up it's Luke Nall, a powerlifter getting into strongman, pulling from a height of 18 inches, that's a good lift. Next up it's the Italian record, the athlete Andrea Invernizzi, it's 401 kilos or 884 pounds, he gets a down signal and that's a new record. Here's a clip from powerlifter Blake Lehu, pulling an incredible 415 kilos or 915 pounds. Now next up I've got an athlete feature on powerlifter Russell Orhi, invited out to South Korea to compete at the 2022 Winter Showdown. That's 340 kilos or 750 pounds in the squat. Here comes his bench press. He says he decided to compete at a body weight of 90 kilos and put on a pretty good performance. Finally, here's his deadlift, the weight 350 kilos or 771 pounds, which gave him a huge meat personal record, a total of 1,951 pounds or 885 kilos. Congrats to Russell. Now next up in the news, I've got the podiums for America's Strongest Woman. Here are the lightweights. First place went to Kira Rickson. Second place went to Carly Oliveira. And in third place, it was Kristen Ellis. Next up it's the podium for the middleweight women. First place went to Nadia Stowers. Second place was Erin Murray. And in third place, Erin Walklet. Following on from this, we've got the Women's Open. And America's Strongest Woman 2022 is Victoria Long. Congrats to her. Second place is Olga Leischuk. And in third place, Inez Carrasquillo. And finally, I've got the men's Open America's Strongest Man 2022. The winner, Bobby Thompson. Awesome result for Bobby. Second place is Tyler Cotton, and in third place, Trey Mitchell III. Now seeing us out today, it's Luke Richardson, looking really strong in the Viking press, coming back from injury, getting ready to compete at next year's Britain's Strongest Man. Anyway guys, that's it from me today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe, and I'll catch you again as always on the next one. Swimming in the lake. Winter time is amazing. Cold weather for strongmen, no problem.